mentioned this briefly here on this show. I've talked about it over on Basic Sorgonomics. I actually did a little bit of an introductory write-up on it over on the 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 newsletter at sorgatron.com uh so please go check that out for some further information thoughts on this but this is a uh, blab and here's a little bit at, and i'll i'll pull up let's see we'll pull up a little bit it's on it's on ios if you're on firefox or google chrome i believe it uses webrtc so you don't need a plugin you don't even need like you know google hangout you even need to put in a plugin uh, on most browsers, right? Um, not necessary here. Uh, I think they do have a plugin now because before it just didn't work a couple weeks ago and now it seems like you can get a plugin on Safari. I don't know if it supports Internet Explorer just yet. So it's still technically a beta, so that's okay. Um, but if you get into it, so this is basically like, it's basically like Periscope if you put four Periscopes together. And the nice part of this, and you know, you guys know, like Google Hangout, I've loved because it's kind of an easy podcast, video podcast in a box solution to me. You go in, you record something, and it goes to YouTube, right? You have stuff for graphics, you have stuff going on right there. And here's actually, if you go on the record in this in this program or in this uh, on the site, it will actually email you a video version and an audio version of that show you just did of that chat you just did uh to the point where you get so i don't click on chill again you get a nice video file that popped <laughs> up to youtube and this is just us messing around thursday night after we did a, the meeting i didn't invite chilla to um but uh and there's there's actually doug Durda uh joining us a little bit so you see here you get kind of this uh, uh four up format right and which is it's kind of awkward if you're doing a video show but if you're doing a podcast it's kind of really nice if you use that audio file now, the cool part on top of this is, and, and there's also an iOS version as well, so you can pull it up on there, kind of like you could Periscope. Um, you log in, and let me see if it will work on this older, little more outdated computer, so I can actually show you a little bit of the functionality here. You log in with your Twitter like you do with a Periscope, so you, I don't think you can log in not with Twitter at this point. Um, and then you have a nice chat on the right. You have, um, I'll just pop into... If you want to be an entrepreneur, you can't be Susan, Sue B. Zimmerman is the first one I clicked on. So let's see what this is about. Uh, so hopefully this loads here. And, and my screen's a little small, so you're not going to see. I'm sorry, Chilla. <laughs> I'm sorry, Chilla. <laughs> so this is going to load up here. And you see we got the tweets about this show here on the left. And uh, the videos are actually loading up. Hopefully they load up here so I can show them off a little bit. And you see we got these little kind of weird hands on here. So you actually will give a little bit of uh, applause. So hello, ladies, for uh, guesting on Awesome Cast. Thank you very much. Um, let's see. I, I don't have my Twitter on here, so now I'll keep lurking. Um, and mm -hmm. again, you know, much like, oh, I can't, I can't click on them. But you can kind of see other people are clicking on uh, the videos here, and, you, and their faces pop up. So you can see who's giving you, you know, quote, unquote, heart, hearts, or, like in Periscope, or on here it's actually called props. And uh, again, you have everybody across the top, like you're familiar with um, on, on Meerkat. Uh, if I had a larger resolution screen, you'd actually see on the right a, a chat room, again, linked to your accounts via Twitter. So you can follow through and follow right through on Twitter and follow them on Blab and on Twitter, respectively. Kind of like Periscope, you follow them on Periscope, you follow them on Twitter in kind of different instances. Um, Katie, we've been talking about kind of the idea of maybe making an interactive show of some sort on here. Mm -hmm. This has been really popular for people that are marketers and such um, to tell to help people show they're really smart. I guess. Well, um, just, I'm watching these ladies on here, and I'm sorry, mm -hmm. ladies, I don't know who you are, mm -hmm. but it, it's it's interesting to see what they're doing to try to improve their appearances. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's just very interesting. To <laughs> it's like very trying pink. to make real life filters is fun to watch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's very pink, and and then they're dressed up. Actually, they're, 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 there's not a lot of rule breaking going on here. They're, they're very very good um, for this. But but I mean, mm -hmm. this really is kind of it's that hangout thing. But it's easier to implement with hangout. I've been trying to get like people that are not involved with computers, like that maybe don't even have a Google account yet, and say, okay, you need to do this. Okay, you need to install this plugin. And that has been a big hurdle for us sometimes. You know, just saying. You know, no, you got to do this, this, and this in order to get here, right? On top of, are do they have a giant light behind them and, and all this other mm -hmm. stuff? Are, or do they have headphones, which are, is very important so you don't have feedback, especially in a situation like this. And also, very few times have I seen video and audio quality that's been bad on here. Um, every I don't know if it's just the people on here are early adopters, so they automatically have good stuff. Like the, these ladies look like they got decent enough webcams and everything, um, but uh, but but it's been up there as far as quality. It's been up there as far as interaction. 
Um, you know, it kind of has that Periscope effect. Plus, it, you know, I've been trying to, I don't, I don't know if you noticed, Katie, I've been using Periscope a little more the last couple of days in like more just, hi, it's me and I'm going to talk to you kind of stuff, mm -hmm. um, which has actually been really like I've been getting a lot of great interaction in there, but I feel like I'm not really saying anything and I need to kind of direct that a little bit more. But now you're not alone, right? Mm -hmm. Which is kind of nice for those introverts like me. They're just like, I can't just talk out to people, you know, um, like that and not really have a point to say anything. Um, but if you get in here, well, hey, let's get in here and talk about this topic. You know, I'd like to get in. I'd like to get in and talk about wrestling on Monday nights, but I'm just too damn tired by the time we get to Monday Night Raw. But um, but 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 I love that. Like, I think it would be fun to get like wrestlers, wrestling fans in here. And, and, and like have an open forum, you know, that they can pop in and, and have a little more control over it rather than um, the weird stuff we used to get when we had open Google Hangouts a few years ago and mm -hmm. decided that was a really, 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 really <laughs> bad idea. Um, so I, I think being tied to a Twitter account, I think that's going to help you with your control a little bit at least. So and you can not let people in. You can lock them and block them or you can just leave an open seat and see who comes in and you can approve them to come in before you do. So, uh, so again, there's a little bit of control there. The west side of Oahu, island of Oahu. Chilla, is that you? That was me. Sorry. <laughs> but um, I, I don't know, Katie. I, I don't know if you've looked too much into this. But what, what do you think about this this service in general so far? Oh, I think I like it. I, I play with it. I, well, I've lurked a little bit. I haven't actually gotten into a conversation myself, mm -hmm. which I probably should at least try that much. But um, no, I like it, and I, I like the platform, and I like being able to watch people talk and interact and um, kind of participate. You know, it's, it's it's interesting. It's like it's like watching a podcast essentially live, and then having some input into that podcast, which I think is great because I, I really I enjoy things that have the more interaction, especially now with uh, I, I just that social media is able to do that for us and the instant video and things, and now you get instant feedback from what you, whatever you're talking about. Mm -hmm. This is uh, a go ahead. I, I, I'm, I'm interested in can you set it up kind of how you do with Wirecast where you kind of output into this or is it just your webcam? No, it's I think it's mostly set up just your webcam. I, I'm sure there's some way to use like a Camtasia or something to, the, to pump in this. I don't see again like like Periscope. I, I don't know what's going on here, by the way. I, I'm just gonna throw this up in the background because <laughs> it's just this is a uh, you suck at blab, you suck at blab. Um, and this guy's just like holding a laptop in very awkward ways as he's going here. But I'll just leave that up for, for visuals. Because well, it would be interesting if you could do it where you streamed this out, not just to YouTube, but you streamed it out to this. And then you could have all of the people in the chat. Right, right. They could be in the, talking on their own as well. They could be in the blab. So wait, wait. So we're like broadcasting to one of the blab corners and then everybody yes. else pops in. So they can have like a talking dead kind of episode over our episode. You're getting <laughs> exactly. too meta. I think you're getting too meta on me because now you have this like a layer on layer on layer. Although that could be interesting. That would be a fun experiment. I, I think it would be interesting to go back and see what other people were getting hooked on. And mm -hmm. you, it could get to the point, right, where we're 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 on to the next topic, and they're still all roundtabling another topic, like right. a, a prior topic that we were on. So I don't know. I could definitely see this this coming in to be a fun tool, depending on how far you can go with it. Mm -hmm. The one thing that I've noticed, and maybe it's just I need to sleep from time to time, between Periscope, this Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, like. There's no way to find enough time in every day to hit every social network to see what's going on. So no, I'm I'm to the point where I need to start paring back, and I, I'm it's gonna be it's gonna take a lot for me to onboard to new upstarts to the to the point where we're making I think back a pod camp. I'll I'll get on there. I'll get my name registered. Yeah, but I, I don't know if I. It's just it's. Trying to keep up with everything is getting to be a bit much, and I'm interested to see how the rest of the world handles all these little things. Are they just going to die on the vine, or right, right. what's going to actually stick? Well, this this is evoked in a lot of the conversations that I've heard. Is, you know, this is evoked like, oh, stick cam and and all these other things. I did tiki chat. I brought up with Doug the other day, <laughs> right? Uh, mm -hmm. You know, those kinds of things. They've come and I've gone, so something needs to hit. And this could, and maybe this can ride the Periscope Meerkat. It's like Periscope and Meerkat. It's like okay, and then because. Mm -hmm. Again, like we talk about Snapchat and Instagram and Twitter starting with that one thing that they do. And then Periscope, Periscope and Meerkat started with that one thing that you can do, right? And now they've started add-on features a little by little, and they're going to become something bigger, right? Uh, and now you have Blab that's it starts with about five things you can do, right? 
um, in a different way, but it, it's added a new, it's, it's, it's kind of, it's kind of a greatest hits of Google Hangout, Periscope, and Meerkat, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And from, from that's, see, yeah. that's what's most interesting. Cause I think somebody looked at like Periscope and Meerkat. Oh, those are great. Cause I love the way it does this and the live streaming and the way this functions over here. But I really love something that records kind of like Google Hangout does, but kind of have like multiple people, but nine people is way too much. You can't really have a good conversation there. So let's limit the four. And then we bring in the Twitter thing, just like Periscope and Meerkat did at, at first when it released. And then, and then you just get like, and then you get blab. By the way, hate the freaking name. I got to get over that. Because um, I was listening to a blab. See, that sentence. Hate that already. Um, I'm listening to that. And they're, they're talking about going and doing blabs. Which is like, I, I, there's so many of these that are blabs about blabs. About doing better blabs. and Which is a thing you're going to do. Because you have like people on Periscope saying, this is what I use Periscope for. And it just kind of gets circular at that point. Um, but I kept saying, I kept thinking they were talking about labs. And I'm like, what is labs? What, what's going on here? And it just completely, I don't know, it was just me. But uh, just not being, being, being in that world yet. But uh, but again, I and, and Katie, yeah, I looked for a bit as well before I finally like, hey. Also, getting people comfortable you know, they were like, hey, you guys, let's try this together and see what happens, mm-hmm. right? Before jumping in, you know, feed first and just let's see what happens, right? Because like, I'm always afraid of the nobody will show up. Like, like sometimes with the periscopes, like, I got a great thing I can periscope right now. Or I'm going to periscope this podcast. 